On the first day of the tour, West Bengal Chief Minister Mamata Banerjee handed over a four-page letter to Prime Minister Modi asking for the centre's help for development projects in the state. In fact, the two leaders had an hour-long meeting at the Raj Bhavan in Kolkata. The Prime Minister also thanked Mamata for her support on the Tista issue and said that he would ensure more flow of funds for West Bengal. Earlier on Saturday evening, the Prime Minister launched three mega social security schemes related to the insurance and pension sector. After the function, the Prime Minister paid a visit to his spiritual guru, Swami Mathananda Maharaj of Ramakrishna Mission. While Prime Minister Modi in an interview to a daily makes it clear that his decency in parliament should not be taken as a sign of weakness, Congress President Sonia Gandhi mounted yet another attack on his government saying that minorities now feel insecure in the country. Speaking at a ceremony to honour eminent editor Vinod Mehta who passed away recently, Sonia Gandhi the president of the party said dissent is being stifled and that the secular fabric of the society is being threatened in the country. She accused the prime minister of running a government of some people for a select few. While the prime minister talking to a daily ahead of the completion of one year of his government said that retaliation and counter-attacks on opposition has never been his government's policy. He said maintaining decency and humility in politics despite all-round attack should be taken, not be taken rather as a sign of weakness. He reiterated his government's willingness to take everyone along. In the present climate, when dissent is being stifled, when the minorities feel increasingly insecure, when the secular fabric of our society is threatened, when bigotry and obscurantism seem to flourish unchecked.